So here I have um, my wire, my wire cutters, uh, batteries. Uh, you do need to make sure these have a charge. We sent you probably new ones, um, but if something doesn't work, that's one of the first things to check. Then I've got all these little magnets. Everybody got a few different ones, but this is the ones I end up with. And uh, you may not have the very same ones, but what we're looking for is enough to basically put on the battery. So it's okay if they're bigger or smaller, we hope. So I've got it like that. And some of you may even have some with with uh, little holes in them, in which case they could go up on, actually it can go on top anyway, but it doesn't stack very well because basically the uh, this thing has a little tip. And yeah, so there we have it. So I'm going to make the simplest one I can. And all I'm going to do is take maybe this much wire these magnets stick everywhere maybe one loop like that right? and then I'm going to start out by just turning the tip to point down like that And then I want it to sit on here. So I need to make it because you want this to touch here and this to be up here. But then if we hold this, that doesn't quite work because there's too much weight over there. So I'll bend this back a little bit. So we set it up, and that touches, so I need to make it shorter, so I bend it a little more, and there you have it. Now you can experiment and do things that are bigger or smaller or lighter um, or more magnets, or see if you can do it with one magnet. Um, or a different battery, so we'll see if this battery is any different. And I'll put that one on those. Want it to tip over. So this one is hitting the fabric, and that's causing it to spring up a little bit. So I can make it just a little bit smaller. And so it's a little bit unwieldy. So there's a lots, of, lots of different examples of this, but the first thing is to just get one work and if you, one to work. And if you can get it to work, then uh, you're doing pretty well. And beyond that, you could try and get it stable, you can spiral it, you can do all kinds of things. So look at the examples online, look at some of the pictures and see if you can get it to run for a long time. These, this one keeps spinning off because it's so big that it, uh, it gets itself sort of out of whack. So one thing I might do is bend that over there a little bit. Oops. The key is to make the bottom touch the magnet. And if you have one of those, um, if you have one of those magnets with a little circle, you can put that on top, and that'll cause it to, uh, to have something to stay on. And the bigger magnets are nicer because they help hold the thing straight. Okay, so you can see that it's easy to mess up, but also easy to fix. In this case. Um, I'm not making contact with a magnet. In this case, I am. And in this 
case that gets caught, so I'll bend that up a little bit. So you can see I've already kind of changed the shape a lot. And you can see a lot of cool ones online. In this case I've got a nice sharp tip that's touching that, but it starts getting to go too fast and it managed to stay but then spins off. So see if you can make one that stays on. And there you have it. So I just uh, had these floating around in the closet of previous experiments. So notice it's not quite touching here. So we'll stop it. So, but it does spin quite freely. What I'm going to do is bend this in just a little bit. A little bit more. And now it's not quite touching the magnet, so we'll go longer. And there we have one. And this one is going a little slower, so it uh, liable will continue to do that until oh, it fell. And here's another one. It's trying to turn, trying to turn. Depending on the kind of copper wire you get, sometimes you need to scrape some away to make contact. We barely have contact down there, which is good because there's not much friction. What I can do is try a different battery as well because this one may have a better charge. And you see that's a bit more vigorous. I, you can make some that go pretty fast and it's interesting to see if you can make them go really fast and stay on. So I'll be surprised if this stays. So far it seems to be doing a good job. Dun, 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 dun,